Now I'm going to take you through the new workflow functionality that comes with NAV 2016 and this enables you to model real life steps which are required in the business to ensure that best practice and industry requirements are followed. Um, I'll show you a very simple example today with relation to a customer credit limit, but there are a number of um, templates in NAV 2016, about 20, which come standard, um, and these can also be configured to, um, to cater for some really complex uh, steps which may occur in your business. So what I'll do is go to a customer. I have set up in the background a workflow here um, for approving a customer's a change to the customer's credit limit. Now here I have a condition that says if the customer's credit limit is over $5,000 I need to then send a notification and an approval to two users um, uh, to then approve that. So if I go to a customer and I'll go to Spots Myers Furnishings and open the customer card in the credit limit field, it's currently zero, and if I increase it to something more than 5,000 and I send approval request, NAV will go into the background and have a look at that set up on that workflow and send a notification to the two users that are set up, my colleague Shello and I, um, to say that we need to improve the in approve the increase in the credit limit um, in order for any further transactions to be done by Spotsmeyer's furnishings. And I'll show you that if we do uh, try and post an invoice, we will be stopped because the approval for this credit limit has not yet been um, given by the required users. So we receive a message to say that the approval request has been sent. So an email has been sent to the two users um, predefined. I say OK. If I open up this sales invoice that um, has previously been created for Spotsmeyer's Furnishings and I open it up and I try to post that sales invoice I will receive um, the required checks um, for this invoice. Yes, I want to post it. And I receive a restriction message to say that um, because of this customer approval workflow, um, I was not able to post the sales invoice. So I say OK and OK. So I'm being restricted because this credit limit hasn't yet been approved. And I can see that if I go to my sent notification entries, I can see that most recently a, an approval entry has been to, sent to Shello on my request via email to go and check um, the customer and approve the increase of the of the credit limit. Now, as I said before, these can be customized to be a lot more complex than that simple approval um, and these can be configured very easily um, without customizations.